This is Rob, you know, BS old school YouTube guy, and I'm here to give you a review of Silver Strand State Beach in Coronado, California. This will be my bicycle review of our two day stay, and uh, I will be right back. Here's the main lifeguard tower. And in this area, we have public restrooms. Good morning, how are you? How's your stay here? Good? Having fun? Awesome. Yeah, have a blast, man. And in here, there's uh, some picnic areas to hang out. And I believe that building right back there is like a little snack shack. And when they opened up in regular season, all the stuff is wide open, selling food and all that good stuff. And then you'll notice over here on the, um, the east side of the parking lot, there's these tunnels. There's like four of these things. You go through these tunnels, it goes under the road, and it takes you. Well, I'm going to show you anyway, since I'm giving you this review. I'm going to take the tunnel, and it'll take us over to the bay side. So if you want to get over and go into that water where it's not quite so choppy or cold. It's a little bit warmer over here. You wouldn't know today. It's cold today because it's cloudy, like I said before. Um, so there's the bay. It's all San Diego Bay right there. And there's an aquatic center right over there by the big palm trees. If you followed any of my other YouTube videos, I did a, a review of Chula Vista um, RV Park. Chula Vista RV Park is directly across over the bay that way. When I did that review, we were looking back over this way at the Navy SEAL um, complex. So here's the bay side. I'm not going to take you in here too far. I'll take you back out there, then I'll show you the rest of the park. We're coming up on our spot here. In spot number 122. We're going to do a walk around and show you what's going on at the beach. We had a neighbor that left early today, so we got this whole left side of us. Kind of expanded our room a little bit and opened up our view. So here are the spots. So we're backed up right to the sand. Literally is at the back of our rig. So the space. There's the edge of our space. You can see the lined out right there. And we come to this side. We get to this side. So they're not all that big. Um, they allow you to back your rear wheels all the way up to this curb if you want. We were having problems with getting our slide out popped out. If we would have moved four inches that direction, we could have backed this thing all the way up and parked our truck in the front. Um, instead, we parked over in the empty lot. So uh, we maximize our space right over here. Here's the beach. Point Loma again. Now you can see those beyond that lifeguard tower. That's Coronado, the city of Coronado. And on the other side of that is downtown San Diego. So here's the back of the spots all the way coming down here. So all these spots have water and electric only, no sewer. So even though you're stacked up on each other, you don't smell anybody's pipe like right next to you because essentially if these things had sewer, there'd be a sewer hook there and there and everybody would be smelling each other's uh, sewer pipe, but that, that doesn't happen. So they've got 50 and 30 amp connect. They do have a dump station at the end of the park for $10 you can dump. Um, there's also a private uh, sanitation truck that comes by 
and will empty out your septic tanks for $25, I believe. So he came in this morning and he had uh, uh, all kinds of people coming over here having emptied the tanks. We'll probably do the same thing tomorrow too. But um, great place. Wish there was a little more sunshine, but hey, we'll take what we can get. Um, a lot of fun. Highly recommend this place. Uh, there's lots to do. We're gonna go into town today and uh, check out Coronado Brewing. And uh, just right across, here's um, Silver Strand Highway that goes over here. Just on the other side, there's a bike path that goes all the way from Imperial Beach, which is south, all the way into Coronado. Nice paved path off the road. You can take that all the way into Coronado. So we're gonna ride that thing today. So um, I'd give this place a uh, nine out of 10 for beach camping. Um, this is our first beach camping spot, and uh, it was a great time. So I hope this helps you make your decisions when you're coming out to camp. Uh, this is Rob with um, your No BS YouTube guy. So I hope this helps. Happy camping.